Don't talk. Don't say a word. It's my turn to explain. All I've done is hound you about being honest. When I couldn't do it myself. That kiss in the courtyard, Sebastian. It was more than just a kiss. I'll say. Now, let me finish. You see, it was my first kiss. I wanted it to be perfect and right and with the right boy. And while you might have been the right boy, the rest was totally not right. I embarrassed you. I embarrassed myself. Because I know you're used to girls with all this experience and you've probably been kissing girls forever. And that's what I was afraid to tell you. Hey. I happen to think this is wonderful, right? So you weren't exactly upfront and honest. Join the club. I wanted it to be perfect. Not the tail end of some prank. Does that make any sense? Yeah. You know, some things can't be orchestrated. Some things have to be spontaneous. Like a kiss. Like the kiss we're about to have right now. Say something. Quick. Okay. I have to go. Last now. Okay, but just back away, so I know you're not running away. That was wonderful. Just precious. How long were you there? I've never kissed a boy before. I mean, the right boy, and you've probably been kissing girls forever. You must feel like a terrible dope leading on that poor, lovesick girl. You don't know what you're talking about. Here's a prediction. A few weeks of hand-holding and chaste smooching, and you'll be so bored and horny you'll mess the whole thing up. Of course, I could wipe her off the map tomorrow, but I think I'll let this little romance just flicker out all on its own. I like the girl, okay? I like her a lot. Do anything to screw it up, and I'll screw you up. Nobody ever threatens me. I just did. Or weren't you listening? You do realize this means war. Then war it is. Ah! Lovely. <laughs> 